Yo, what's going on, guys? So today will be kind of an interesting video. Um, GeoGuessr recently came out with a new feature for high-rated players um, called Investigations, where um, pretty much from my, what I understand, high-rated players can review cases where there's been questionable gameplay, right? Suspected cheating like Googling or scripting or something like that. And high-rated players can kind of review the video footage to see if they think um, that the person was cheating or if they think that it's fair or if there's just not enough evidence to see at the time. So today we're just going to review some of these cases and kind of see what's going on. So tag along. You're kind of here to keep me honest and let me know if you disagree with any of these rulings. So we'll see. Okay, so I like at the top left, it tells us that our game mode is moving, so that's nice. The recording is playing, um, but the player is not moving, unless the game mode is glitched out and it's like a NMPZ or something. No, okay. Yeah, they're just doing some weird stuff, okay. Looking around, seeing the landscape, should be just Iceland. We have Valholt. Player is moving extremely slow. Not really sure what's going on. Very odd. And zooming straight into Reykjavik. But they are updating it to Selfos at the last second, and it ends up being Selfos. Uh, see, this is where I really wish that it would show ratings of the players. Um, I find this really sus, but at the same time, it's one of those things where if you're not 100% sure, you need to go for insufficient evidence. So I don't think that they really could have Googled here. Um, it's possible they were scripting, but I think right now there's just insufficient evidence. So um, I want to be really sure whenever I submit a guilty verdict on one of these guys. So going into this next round, <clears throat> looks like we are in Israel. Yeah, can tell pretty quickly from the road, from the yellow plates, and he goes in. Yeah, total fair guess. I don't see anything sus about that. Um, that that's going to be a not guilty verdict. Okay, going into the next round, looks like we are in uh, South Korea. Okay, looking at the sign. How long are we going to look at this? has not pulled up the map. It's one thing if you're looking at a sign and you're pulling up a map, kind of scanning for it, but this looks kind of sus. Probably just Googling Homigot or Daibo. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah, and going to such a weird specific place. How close are we? Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, I find that extremely sus. Um, I don't think that you are scripting here, but I do think that the amount of time that you kind of zoomed in here, that the user looked at the sign, I think that that's almost definite for Google. So um, I'm almost certain that that would be Googling. Okay, going into our next case, this one is fairly rapid. Looks like we are back in the Philippines. Got some palms, looking across a bridge. Recording is almost over. And just Middle Plunks, Philippines. Yep, I think that was a perfectly normal um, guess there. I don't think there was anything crazy. Kind of surprised that this got um, this got submitted. But yeah, I think we can safely say not guilty on both accounts. Okay, next round, loading up. <clears throat> Actually, a somewhat tricky round. Um, my brain went to Argentina, but... I'm not certain, actually. It's a decent length recording. This person's moving fairly slowly. You would think a high-level player would have already moved around. We do have a sign. Did look like Latin America. Mina Ethel, okay. No, man, don't do it. Don't do it. Oh, clearly staring at the sign. And at this point, I think that it has been long enough to have Googled and found a place. And yeah, he's just going straight from staring at the sign after a pause. Yeah. Yeah, that looks bad. Goes straight into it in Argentina. Ooh. 
Yeah. That is crazy. I'm surprised he didn't like just kind of plonk from space in the general area. But yeah, no, this is a. Yeah, that's an absolute Google there. I don't think there's anything questionable about that. Um, don't see any evidence of scripting, but yeah, that's going to be a Googler for me. Got to submit that one. Okay. <clears throat> On to our next case. We have yellow plates, so I'm assuming this is the UK. Um, looks like English, no camping. <clears throat> I think I've actually, I don't know, been known strand. The known strand. Okay, didn't stay on the sign for too long. That's good. Very good. I would think it would be somewhere in northern UK. Could be northern Ireland. He is going to the coast, so that lines up. And you can see some body of land to the northwest. So this is somewhat gettable. Oh, and he sees Benown Beach. Yeah, it looks like he is basically 5K the location. Yeah, that's almost certainly the 5K. Um, let me go back and check one thing. How long was he staring at the first time that he saw the known strand? It's a few seconds. Um, but I think this is see this is a great example of where the skill skill level of the player would be so important to know, because if we knew that this was a high rated player, then this would be you know very easy to diagnose as not cheating. But if this is a low rated player, then it would be more indicative that they did not they wouldn't be able to do this. Um, and it's because of that unknown that I think that this is insufficient evidence for googling uh, and scripting. I think just definitely not guilty. So we're gonna go ahead and submit that. Okay, on to our next round. Um, we'll probably do one more after this and then call it a night. It's weird. It looks like the player is zoomed in very far. Uh, I can't. I think we're in Cambodia. He just plonks from high up and then goes central Cambodia. Yeah, I, the only thing sus about that is that he was like permanently zoomed in, but I don't see any, anything um, anything crazy there. Okay, on to our final round here. This will be our last review for the day. Um, looks like some dark soil. Got overcast coverage. Probably in Cambodia here. It's no moving game. And he just space plonks Cambodia. Looks a little northern. Then he corrects it. Let's see what, how close this guess was, because that's going to determine. Uh, I think it was a really good guess, but his initial guess was like up here. So it would be one thing if he like 5K plunked from space and then updated his guess to be further. Um, but that didn't look like the case here. I think that it was a genuine plonk. Yeah, and then he moves it downward. I wish that we could see the map change in real time, but yeah, it looks like he was up here and then moves downward. Um, so yeah, I think that this is also, uh, I don't think there's any evidence that he was Googling or, or scripting or anything here. So we'll submit that and call it a day. Anyway, guys, so that's a little bit about our investigations thing going on here at GeoGuessr. I thought it was interesting. I saw a couple other pro players doing some like decisions that I don't know if I agreed with, with the guilty versus not guilty so i just kind of wanted to do a few of my own and highlight them to see if you guys disagreed or agreed with any of the rulings so hope you guys enjoyed let me know if you like this we'll do some more thanks